Hi everybody! So I am still working on my sewing project. It's actually hanging right here, but it is a Renaissance dress inspired by Marguerite from Ever After. Um, but I have an unboxing to do. So this is the spindle I've been using. It's very heavy and my hands get sore after a while of trying it, but I think my yarn is coming out better. Maybe. <laughs> um, so I ordered a spindle off of Etsy that should be lighter. It is, I'm not really showing the box because of my address, but this is the box it came in. All right, Let's see, does she have a card? Okay, so the company that I ordered this from is Bull Sheep. Oh, that's funny, I didn't even realize that when I ordered it, that's funny. Um, so they do spindles, fibers, and yarn uh, by Sarah Margis? Margis? I'm not sure how to pronounce that. <laughs> I'm not the best at pronouncing names. But anyways, that's their shop. They wrote me a little note. Alright. So it came in a little pink tissue. Okay, oh, oh, it's so cute. Okay, so this is the spindle. It's purple. So they gave a little bit of fiber that's really beautiful. What a beautiful gray. I wonder how if they have this in their shop. It's really beautiful. It's gray with sparkles in it. Oh, I would love to spin more of that, but so they, they 3D print the um, whorl and I thought it was really beautiful in the picture and it's actually prettier than I thought it would be. Um, there's the little groove for where the fiber goes. The um, shaft of the spindle is like a, a silvery, yeah, I think it's made out of some type of metal, but let me check the difference. Where did my spindle go? My other one. Oh, here it is. My cat's laid on it. Um, this one is a lot lighter than this one, and it's very pretty. It's kind of purple and almost witchy looking, but since she sent this with it, I'm going to try to go ahead and, um, let me get a leader. I'll be right back. I'm back. So a leader can be just like any type of scrap yarn you have around or if you have like yarn you don't think you're going to use, can, can cut off a piece, put it in a little circle and then, um, so I'm taking it like this and I'm going to pull it through to loop it and that'll just help get it started. And look at this hook. Interesting. But that... That is so pretty. Oh, I forgot to show you the best part. I don't know if it'll, if it'll do it. Let me turn off the light. Okay, is it gonna show? Okay, I'm gonna have to try to find a dark place because it's supposed to glow in the dark. <laughs> that was, that's like one of the best parts about this one. Um, okay. Um, I'll do that at the end. I'm going to try to find a dark space so that I can make it go in the dark and see what it looks like because that part's like actually really exciting. Okay, so my leader yarn and I'm going to put it through the little groove and then, oh, I'm going to do it to this side. Okay. <laughs> okay, so there's a groove on each side that makes it easier. Okay. So. Oh my gosh, no! Princess, my cat just grabbed fiber off of here. You get back in. Okay. So I am going to, I'm gonna just draft it out a little bit to make it easier. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna try to start this. Just so to start it, I'm going to just put the end through the loop and then 
I'm going to spin it and then let the twist go up into it. Now I'm gonna wind it around the shaft. This is beautiful fiber. I want more. Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Okay. Put that back in. <laughs> okay. This is my new favorite spindle. I love this one. This one spins so much easier for me than the one I ordered on Amazon. Shouldn't be surprised. Um, I am so happy I got a lighter weight one because now I think I can actually make yarn that I really like. I just needed a lighter weight spindle. But I can't, this is, fiber is beautiful. I want more of it. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna roll this. Okay, and now I'm gonna draft a bit out more. Maybe I need to back up. Okay, so I'm holding it between my legs. I don't think you can still see. <laughs> okay. So you can see how I'm holding it. Um, so I'm gonna just draft out some. Um, so beautiful. I'm gonna have to look at her shop and see if they have more of this because I actually really love this fiber. I prepared the first fiber I've ever tried so I might not be the best at making fiber but I guess I just need to practice. <laughs> Okay, so I highly recommend this Etsy shop's fiber and spindle. It's beautiful. The spindle is beautiful. The fiber that they sent for to go with it is beautiful. Um, this is a lot easier to work with than that other spindle. I actually enjoy, I'm enjoying the heck out of using the spindle right now. It's absolutely beautiful and the weight is so much better I'm almost out It's a little over twist.
I'm actually really sad that I'm out of the the fiber at the end got a little wonky but this is absolutely beautiful <laughs> all right I have no more of this to spin so um, here is my review on this spindle 10 out of 10 love it beautiful easy to work with so much easier than that other spindle the fiber that they sent me worked beautifully and I'm might maybe try to order some more from them if they have like the same gray absolutely beautiful all right thank you for joining me and i hope you have a good day bye